But well, welcome back everybody to 7 Days and I'm an old guy gaming and in this episode we are going to build our ballistics table uh, and then uh, we will go do some more questing. So that is the plan. All right, so let's get started with this. Uh, we are going to have to make it over at the workbench, but we should be able to uh, see what the recipe is here. So let's go ahead and pin that. Uh, all right, so it's going to want us to make a log table. So we need three of those and some of this and some of the, uh, no, not those. Some of this, I think, for the for the log table. Let's get that made first. Okay, next thing it's going to want us to do is get 200 iron. So we'll get 200 iron. We got that. Next thing it's going to want us to do is 50 plastic. All right. Uh, next thing it's going to want is a bench vise. So to make that, we need 10 ingots, two springs, and two pipes. All right. So 10 ingots, two pipes, and two springs. And that should be, yeah, that's enough for them to make the vice. Okay, so let's get that going. Uh, we're going to want 30 pieces of paper. We're going to want 10 cans, 10, 10 cans. Five oil. And two duct tape. Okay, let's put this and that back in there. Let's grab the bench vise, and we're going to head over to our work bench and make ourselves a ballistics table. Okay, let's make this, and then uh, we'll, we'll go back to the base, set it down, and I think what we're going to do, we don't have very much gunpowder. I can't make gunpowder yet until I make chemistry bench. can't make chemistry bench until we get the tier 2 uh, research station, uh, and we're looking for books on that deal. Um, but I do have some gunpowder, and I think what we'll do with the gunpowder that we do have is we will make some pipe bombs. Okay, let's see here. We'll grab the ballistics table, and uh, I think I'm going to actually, and yeah, we don't want to put it there. Let's just put it right there. This bird's nest does uh, re-pop, so I don't want to destroy it. So, for pipe bombs, we need... Where are the pipe bombs? I know we know how to make them. There we go. Um, 12 gunpowder pipes and fiber. So, it's basically the same ingredients as vanilla. I don't know if the quantities are the same, but the ingredients are. Uh, and that's all we have for gunpowder. Uh, so, let's grab the pipes out of here and the grass out of here. Let's also turn you off. You're just burning fire for no reason. Burning fire? Really? Okay. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. Burning fuel is what I meant to say. Burning fuel for no reason. That's what I meant to say. Okay, that leaves us 11 gunpowder left over, so we're just going to put that back in here for now. Um, And we already have two pipe bombs, too, so we're going to make nine, so we'll have a total of 11. All right, now, next thing is we we need to eat. So let's make some bacon and eggs. With that, we'll put this meat back in here. And let's see, these gives it, they give us 10, so 30, 15. Yeah, the, if we just eat all three of these, that'll get us almost exactly topped off with food. So let's just do that now. We can uh, do the bacon and eggs later. We'll do a red tea. Um, I'm going to put that coffee back. That can go back, too. Uh, all right. So uh, I want to change these to this. I'm going to try an experiment. The next time I block a door, I'm going to try this. Uh, because you know how sometimes when they crouch down, uh, that way we can still hit them you know, when they're crouched down. And we'll give that a try. I am, you know, uh, blocking doors less and less as we get stronger and stronger. But we still, we're still not at the point where we can completely avoid doing that. All right, so I think we're in pretty good shape. Looks like all of our weaponry is in reasonably good shape. Let's make sure everything is loaded. You, oh, are we, 
Out of 44s? We are. Okay, you know what then? This isn't really doing us a whole hell of a lot of good, is it? Why don't we go back to our mongrel for now? Um, you know, because it's better than nothing, right? And that's already loaded. Okay. Cool beans. Let's get this stuff out of here. Turn that off. Because we don't want to keep burning fire. <laughs> oh, no, I kill me. Let's take one of those with us, and we're going to go talk to Trader Hugh and get ourselves a job and go do a job. Now, here's the thing. We need books, and we need books, and whoops, and we need more books. And we can't really do Tier 3 quests from Trader Hugh because there's, no, there's only one Tier 3 POI in this whole entire little dinky town that we're in. Um, and, you know, if that one refreshes, of course, we'll do it. But the other ones, you know, they're just sending us too far away. And we can't open the damn end loot crate anyways because we need lock, pith lock picking 50, which I'm still a little bit frosty about, to be honest with you. Um, but it's the way this mod works. So, all right, let's take your jobs. So all of these are too far away. So we're going to go back to previous tier. And um, let's just do fetch at Victorian house. Situation, yeah, okay? okay, we'll do that. But... I'm going to, you know, I'll probably keep doing tier twos from him just because, you know, we get the rewards and the XP and stuff. But we might start kind of getting away from questing all of the time and just start randomly hitting POIs, particularly ones we haven't been to yet. Because, you know, we want, we need those books. But you know what else we need is we need to find a small engine because we're going to need that to make the mini bike. I believe we can uh, research the mini bike in the research desk. But we can't actually make it until we follow, uh, find a small engine. Um, so, in other words, we can research, research the frame and the handlebars, but we can't actually make it, you know, until we find that small engine. Okay. So we're probably going to start doing a little more random looting and not so much being tied to the quest. But, you know, we might as well keep doing those two while we're doing the random looting, and we'll we'll try and mix it up a little bit. I did also find a treasure map, but we have the same problem with the treasure maps. And uh, whoa, look at that. <laughs> I love it. Man, I am a BMX star. Ooh, shit. There's a doghouse. That's not good. Um, So, yeah, we, we can't even do buried treasures because those chests are locked too, right? And I'm guessing we probably need at least 50 lockpicking to do those. So we're just kind of stuck. We really are. We, we're, we're stuck in this little stupid town. I don't have a motorized vehicle to go real far. And we can't open up the end loot, you know, from the tier three quests or from the buried treasures. So, yeah, it's just uh, that's kind of where we're at. You know, I mean, we'll eventually we'll eventually get bit past that. We will. It'll happen. But it's just kind of slow going right now. And that's OK. You know, actually, if you think about it, it's OK. This mod is not it's not as bad as Ravenhurst, but it's still not a mod that you can progress really quickly. And it just takes a while. And, and again, that's not a bad thing, really, if you think about it. Okay, how the hell am I supposed to get in this place? Um, our thingamadoodle's upstairs. I'm too busy jabber drawing here, not paying attention to how we get in here. Oh, over here. Okay. So let's head up this way. Any Zikaroos in here? No, we do have a trash thing over there. We're going to have to take this out. Okay. Now, Zeke's down here, maybe? Not that I can see. We want to be looking in all of these cardboard boxes, because that is a very good place to find books, among other things. They're very... Um, they're very productive here in this mod. The cardboard boxes are. All right. Uh, we're going to probably have some dog action. Let's get uh, our oh shit rifle ready here. And we'll sneaky sneak and see what happens here. I have done this POI before. It's just been a while. Look at that. Okay, so... Um, I, I can't, I don't have, I have too much spread on this rifle. I mean, we might hit him and we might not, you know what I mean? 
Uh, so I wonder if we should try and do this instead. Okay, that worked. <laughs> Let's grab the light. That worked. That worked quite nicely, in fact. Let's keep this ready just in case there's another pooch around. Look at that, man. He landed right on the freaking... Uh, oh, that's Darlene. She's not a pooch, but she's dangerous, too. Right on. We're starting to get some, some one-shotters now uh, on these Zeeks, which is great. I love it. Not every time, of course, but we're getting better. We are getting better. Okay, let's grab that. Look at that, man. Look at us go. Look at us go. What is our archery up to? Let's take a look at that. Uh, skills, archery. See, it's already up to five and almost to six. Look at us and our bad selves. I love it. All right. Anybody else back here? Let's just be ready to, to go in case there is. Uh, there's a book. All right. We're getting closer, you guys. We're getting closer. Okay, let's go this way. We have to go through here. Uh, just looking to see if there's any... Buddy, we can sneaky sneak through here. Doesn't look like it. Okay. Janitor Jake. <laughs> okay. Awesome. 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 Awesome possum. Let's take this. We are not going to have a problem lighting our, our base, our ultimate base, whatever, whatever and whenever that happens to, to be. Yeah, that's right. I remember this. We go into this downstairs basement with the weight room in it. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. And we just hit level six, too, on our bow skill. Can you imagine once we get to level 90 <laughs> how good we're going to be with this? You know, plus we, plus this is a shit bow. I mean, it's a shit level bow. It's actually not a bad bow. It's been served us well so far. But yeah. Okay, take that. Let's see what's in the shoddy Messiah crate. Twenty steel arrowheads. That's not bad. That is not bad. I have, I don't know. Something like that back at the base already, so we might consider making ourselves some steel arrows for the, you know, for the meaner, meaner zombos that we have to deal with. Okay. Let's open this. Let's get rid of this thing. Is that somebody down there? Anybody going to pop out of the ceiling? Okay, I think we're good in this room. Are they behind that mirror? This isn't a this isn't a clear quest, so we don't get the red dots. They are okay. Is that, is that the only one? Yep. Okay. Sneaky sneak. Oh, another book. Lovely. We like books. We totally like books. Uh, okay. Got a trash in there. There is no charges in that thingy me doodle. Thingy me doodle. Okay. Up the stairs we go. Well, hello there. Oh, shit. You too. Conk. And conk. And conk. And conk. There we go. All right, what do we got here? Seven, nine, two rounds. Okay, not bad, not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, we're probably okay to... Come up to this immediate area. 
now? Okay, let's grab the stuff out of here. Lutsky, Lutsky, no charges in that coffee maker. Some presto logs. Okay, and there's a purse up here. Eight dollar dollar bills. Okay, I think we're clear in this room. I don't see anything that would attack us or any place for them to unless they pop out the ceiling or something. Hopefully the floor doesn't collapse on us. Wait, is that? That's a seed, right? Yeah, okay. Let's see who's in here. Can't really tell, huh? That door's locked. All right, let's get rid of this stuff. And get ready to rumble, because I can't tell. Yep, there is a Zeke over there. All right, you know what we're going to do? Let's put that there. Let's see if we can quietly go right here so we can do this. <laughs> All right. I love it. I love it, man. Okay. Anything behind there? Nope. Let's get the bit of the goodies from the bed here. Okay. Zombos? All right, just one. Down with your mang. Ooh, are there Zeke's in there? Nope. There could have been, but there wasn't. Nothing there. Okay, let's get the good stuff from this. Bandages. Don't need anything out of there. All right. Up the stairs we go. Zombie closet there. Yeah. There's somebody in there, all right. Okay. How many are we dealing with? They dead. They be dead. Totally dead. Well, they already were dead, but they're even more dead. They're no longer walking dead. That's the kind of dead that they are now. All right. Anybody? Oh. Easy there, OG. Don't get cocky, man. You're doing good, but don't get freaking cocky. I don't want to die anymore, you guys. I really don't because it's just, you know, the setback with the skill points and all that is just uh, almost disheartening. <laughs> really, seriously, it just sucks so bad. Um, So, yeah, let's not die anymore. No more dying allowed. Absolutely no more dying allowed. Nothing there. Look at all this leather. Yeah, there is a Marlene right there. Say goodnight, Gracie. Okay. 
Yeah, I'm enjoying the the bow actually. I've you know you guys who watch me all the time, you know I tend to favor crossbows, but I'm actually enjoying this bow. That doesn't mean we won't ever use a crossbow in this playthrough. Because I mean, let's face it, if I find a really nice crossbow in some prize, uh, we're gonna use it, right? But I mean, I'm I'm gonna I'm just gonna scrap that. Uh, I do want to uh, use the bow more though, so we shall. Poppin' pills. Give us a large medi kit, please. Or chemistry, a chemistry bench schematic. That's what we need. No, that's still not bad stuff, though. We'll take it. We will take it. Um, once again, we'll scrap that for the research data for now. At some point, we'll probably come across it and actually consume it, but... It's not a priority right now. I'm not even thinking about farming. We probably won't do any farming at all until we get our permanent base set up. All right. Let's try this first. Ooh. Oh, okay. You know what we're going to do with this? We can turn this into a schematic instead of eating it. Uh, the last time I found one, I forgot about that and I ate it. Not this time. We're actually going to save that and learn it so that way we can make it. Okay, let's look at the fat loots. Uh, another map that we can't do a damn thing with because we don't have lockpicking level 50. Can we even tr attempt this? Use walls. Oh, you know what? I don't have any lockpicks on me. How long would it take to break this? A long ass time. <laughs> Way more time than I want to take trying to do it. Did we get stuff out of here? Uh, oh yeah, that was the satchel. All right, guys, let's go do our turning. What you hey, got, Mang? I hope you didn't look incredible. Iron shovel or a scrap helmet? Out. Both of these are shit rewards. Son of a bitch. All right. Um, we might need this for crafting something later, and that would save me from having to make it. That is not as good as what we're wearing, because I think we're wearing a G quality. So let's just grab that for practical purposes. Uh, all right, so previous tier, fetch at Victor. Didn't we just do that? I have a job for you, if we can come to an understanding. I don't know if that's the same house or not. Well, yeah, let's grab it again, whatever. What's in here? I don't think we need any of that stuff right now. All righty then, so it is almost night time. So why don't we plan on for the next episode? Let's just plan on a random loot session. And in fact, what I think we're going to do for the next episode is I'm going to live stream it. And but I'll also record it. Um, so, yeah, I'll, I'll do uh, sometimes what I will do is I'll, I'll live stream, but I'll still do it in Let's Play format. Um, so I'll have like the alerts and all that thing turned off during the stream. So for you guys that are watching it later, it doesn't really make any difference other than you might hear me occasionally talking to people and it's not because I'm crazy. Well, I am crazy, but you know what I'm saying, right? Um, so maybe, you know, I'm going to do some live streaming. It is Friday night and, um, but we'll also see if we can record a couple episodes. And, and I think what I'm going to do during that live stream is I'm just going to go, we might knock that quest out too, but I think I'm just going to start randomly and systematically um, looting the rest of the POIs in this town. And once we're done with that, you know, we got to get out of here, you guys. We just do. We got to get out of here. But I really, really want a motorized vehicle before we do that because, you know, exploring on the bike sucks. <laughs> it really does. So, yeah, we'll just uh, see how that goes. But anyway, I'm going to let you guys go here. Thanks for watching. hope you enjoyed the episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And actually, let's, oh, we need, oh shit, we need research stations tier two. We need more books, you guys. We need more books. Okay, how many do we have? We have 10. Okay, we only need 10 more books before we can make research station tier two. We are going to hang on to this, and I'm even going to put it in here. And not in the food chest, just so I don't accidentally derp out and eat it not meaning to. Uh, all right, bye.